1st of June 2011, scientists mapped the terrain under the East Antarctic, uh, covered in an ice sheet, so they measured under the ice sheet what the terrain was like, the surface of the rock under the water too. The most unreachable place on Earth until that point. Radar and satellite imagery made that possible. The first synthetic trachea, um, actually windpipe, uh, was implanted in a human being, curing that person of cancer. The replacement was made or grown using the patient's stem cells cloned from that patient, although it is still ethnically questioned. I think it's actually illegal to do these sort of things only under certain tests. August 2011, discovery. Sorry, I got confused because I was just looking at that at the side. Um, discovery, and I thought I'd have the rover discovery. At the same time, I'll, I'll go back because the, there was a discovery in 2011 of microfossils. Uh, they date from 3.4 billion years ago. So, in the area of 12 houses. I will say that was a telephone wire that was crossing over. What a beautiful day, Manchester. And at this section, I'm just going to show you there was a tramway of some description. It crosses over the bridge over the canal, it goes into the Mount Zion area. Uh, Mount Zion Works is at the bottom. We'll walk round to the crane, this old steam crane. But this tramway would have been coal powered, steam, or some other description. But yeah, it says tramway on an old map, and this is the straightest line. Walk along to the docks near the Mount Zion crane. So we see the completion in this year of the Tian Gong 1. That's the Chinese space station. In 2011, the first section of it was successfully launched. This year, we'll see it completed. And that orbits the Earth. That's the technology we're up to from electric trains and canals, roads, and this is where we're going in the future. 2012. Uh, a transistor the size of an atom so that's some form of microchip the size of an atom or something transistor the size of an atom Voyager that's it not discovery Voyager 1 I, I confused myself earlier sorry Voyager 1 becomes the first object made by humans to leave the solar system it first maps and took pictures of the planet and then it travelled on. Physicists at CERN, which is a big collider for physics, and it can collide, well, basically atoms in there. So, Voyager 1 is the first thing made by humans. Physicists at CERN found evidence of Peter Higgs. Uh, yeah, the theoretical boson. It's the smallest and fastest of all particles. Uh, theoretically, it exists, and it's what gives mass to other particles. Uh, they existed seconds after the Big Bang, 
and we joined with other particles, giving them density, and therefore they'll last forever. So we reach Mount Zion steam powered crane. This is a grade 2 listed structure. And we'll show how it used to lift cargo from the canal and also load the canal with paper. But logs were also floated along the canal. Show you a bit of forest in after this crane. This is a forest area that's been cut away. So it's a paper pulp mill. Incidentally, uh, at this point we're in Little Lever. The areas near Knob End where the locks are to the Salford Canal. And we should get to the aqueduct fairly quickly. Uh, joining with other particles being passed as well theoretically, we can't detect them because we've either joined with other things or they're moving other than joined to other things so it just travels very fast through everything in layman's terms that means that you're learning it for the first time uh, they think it's there but it has to be proven so they have to find it uh, but Peter Higgs was born 1929 in Newcastle upon Tyne in England. Uh, the large proton collider smashes particles together uh, near light speed, hoping to spot the boson in a fraction of a second after the collision, which is trying to mimic the Big Bang. Uh, the first bird flew, 2013. H79N, or N9 infected humans for the first time from an animal uh, it caused concern for the future of viruses and vaccines uh, the year 2020 we're currently in a worldwide epidemic of coronavirus and no one's sure how serious that will be quite a lot of people are apparently dying but I don't have any facts on that but it is somewhere in the region of about zero point of the world population that are sort of infected it's not it could be worse than it is at the moment so everyone's worried and they don't know what to expect so curiosity <laughs> killed the cat that's not actually a true saying it's something else curiosity cured the cat is the original saying from England curiosity rover designed by NASA sends its first HD images of Mars along with dust samples and other data. Hubble telescope finally produces a deep field image of space. The sites, Lady Shore coal mining on the other bank. You can see evidence of the bare rock. It's been dug away. And this is the point where the canal from the berry area, it's in Bolson now, it goes dry. I'm just going to try and film down this shaft where the water seems to drain away down towards the Irwell. We're near Ashclough Paper Mill and Bailey Row. Bosco or Boscow fold and we're on Silver Hill. There's a weir situated in the Irwell. To the left hand side. And we're now in Knob End. The area is called Knob End, by the way. It's Prestley. Lock gates. These are the only lock gates um, along this system because it's totally level. Well, the stretch between Berry and Bolton is completely level anyway. You can hear the sound of the weir. 
as we get to the locks. It's still unknown how big the universe truly is, or what shape it actually is. But it did confirm what most scientists thought. Um, the universe was found, well confirmed, its age was 13.82 billion years old. Stem cells are transplanted in rats. One successful kidney transplant and another to replace a brain damaged tissue. Number 8184. 8,184 of these at least were produced. And just the UK brief videos of time.